I came across another survey the other day um, about Filipinos being racists. Um, I'll be honest with you, I don't think Filipinos are racist. They do say some funny things, but a lot of the time it's more to do with education. It's more to do with um, things haven't evolved for 50, 60 years. So politically correct, I don't think exists in the Philippines. I remember uh, an advert in one of the Cebu newspapers for a crop year. Uh, it was asking for a, I think it was 19 to 25 year old female that was pleasing to the eye. Now, try putting that in a UK newspaper and see what happens. <laughs> but that's just the way it is. It's not done in a negative way, but they, they just say it as it is. They say things as they, you know, just want to say it. And it's not, um, and in some ways it's not actually wrong because at the end of the day, if you've got 40 people going for that interview and you're only going to employ that person, what was the point of wasting everybody else's petrol or whatever? The fact is you weren't going to give them the job. Um, so some of these things I do think the PC brigade have gone too far. Um, I also think generally Filipinos don't say in um, a way that's in, a, in an aggressive way. I mean, the odd thing is if in the UK, if you were at a, a dinner with somebody and a guy you work with is uh, black, maybe you're not allowed to say black now, uh, African, Caucasian, whatever, whatever, you know, you come up with it, whatever name they want to call it today. Um, because if you're working in like social housing you know, or social service and stuff, they are so PC brigade is is funny um but not funny in a good way but you can imagine john the the black guy you work with and somebody says oh you should meet john and then they'll say oh well, who's john um oh he's the he's he's a tall guy he's the oh there's there's a few tall guys in here <laughs> you can get the comedy scene out of it you know at the end of the day they avoid saying the obvious and for me that just doesn't make sense because um, it's not done in a negative way I mean a guy I mean it's like me I'm white I, I don't care if somebody says oh Matt's the white guy over there it's not going to make me burst into tears but the PC brigade have gone so absurd on these things but the funny thing is I don't think the PC brigade exists in the Philippines so when people go oh they're racist I I think they misunderstand racism. I think racism should be tied to having a negative um, attitude, not just what you say verbally. Um, you know, it should be actually connected in a negative way. You know, when, if somebody says, I hate black people, for example, that is a negative way. But it's saying, oh, John's the black guy over there. That's not negative. It's, it's stating the obvious. So when this come out, this survey, the first thing I was thinking, I don't think people don't even understand people in the Philippines. I don't think they understand what racism means. I think PC Brigade have generated jobs out of complaining. Um, it's it's a bit like um, What's that series? Black Sails. Black Sails is about pirates. Um, now, for some bizarre reason, there's now gay and lesbians in it. Now, bearing in mind that would have got you executed back in those days. Um, I have no problem with people being people, but when they start altering history, um, and not only that, they have to squeeze stereotypes and... Um, gay couples and that into nearly everything these days it then goes past reality which sort of defeats the whole objective of equality it just gets irritating um because i've got no interest in what people get up to behind closed doors and whatever but at the same time i don't need to see it on uh, anything that i come across you know and I, I don't understand it. I don't know what the drive is, why it has to be in people's faces all the time. Um, 
And this is why I find this a bit bizarre with this, all the Filipinos are racist. I don't think they are. And I also say they're not anti-gay as well in most cases. You might find you've got the uh, egotistical uh, macho types, but they generally don't like anybody anyway. They're not, they're not singling out uh, Filipino gays. They just dislike most people. Um, but when I look at um, Filipino gays, for example, most successful politicians or people in the media or whatever are associated or have an assistant that is normally gay. The church may condemn people to burn in hell, but who does all the flower arrangements for all the, uh, the shows? It's the gay community. So I can't understand why people would say, oh, they're right, Filipinos are racist. Because I don't think they actually are in any capacity. I don't see um, as big an issue as people like to create. You know, I don't think anybody would refuse to employ somebody because they were gay or black or whatever. Because Filipinos don't do that. I would assume they wouldn't refuse to employ me because I was white. Now that would I agree with because there's an inferiority complex. Um, they would assume you wouldn't want the job because you're white. But that is something that has been ingrained through um, the Japanese in World War II and also uh, the Spanish rule for 300 years. So i got to cut them some slack because at the end of the day that was pushed into them in the first place um, to make them uh, believe they were an inferior race um, for Japanese and Spanish to profit off them. So got to keep people the slack that have had these issues but at the same time they don't I've never had anybody negative in the Philippines even complain about the atrocities the Japanese did. I do know the older generations will never forget um, I know of um, my wife's grandfather was a um, what do you call it he was a scout um, with the US US Army uh, I think it's with the Rangers um, but the fact is he may have hated the Japanese his generation but today most people wouldn't even talk about it you know it's not even brought up where a lot of the problems in other countries is based around people having a chip on their shoulder for things that happened not to them or may not even be related to them at all um, it's just an assumption that there's a problem um, I don't get it I really don't um, and like I said Filipinos are so laid back I can't understand where people would accuse them of being racist really don't it's just they don't they don't see it as an issue you know that's the I think that's that half the battle is they're using a bit of common sense where they're not actually trying to create a PC thing where you can't say this can't say that can't do that because the fact is they're not actually seeing anything as a problem so as such there is no problem um, let me know what you think because like I said I've never had any issues and I don't know anybody has any issues with it that has been to the Philippines like I said immigration officials they'll target anybody I think Japanese and Koreans get hammered more than Westerners do anyway um, because they seem more acceptable to corruption but let me know what you think